Good morning, Smooth Skins. So today I think we're going to be heading over to do a bit of exploration underground. If you recall a while back, we found an entrance to Kenmore Station and I wanted to see what was down there. Could be survivors, could be uh, who knows what down there at this point. And I thought we'd take a look. These statues always kind of freaked me out, not going to lie. In any case, that would be up this way. Oh, and before I forget, let me turn my mind detector back on. Had off for the night, of course. Didn't want to uh, have it running. No point, really. That scared me, I'm not going to lie. Jeez. Dog did not want to die. The survivor probably didn't either, but it looks like that dog ate him. What do we have here? Eh, crappy 10 mil. Okay. I brought out the, uh, pipe gun today. I have so much ammo for this thing, and it's a decent enough sniper weapon. Not great for long range, or not great for, um... Heavily armored targets, but, uh, I don't think we'll run into those down under the surface. In fact, I'm not sure what we'll find, but we can always turn around if we find something a bit too out of our league for this thing. Okay, so yeah, let's head in. More fungus. I hope we can find a way to cook that at some point. Ah, ghouls. Interesting thing about ghouls, they're difficult to take down unless you get a headshot on them, then it's pretty easy. I'm also curious about something I found previously. Let me take a second to equip it out here. I brought it with me today. Recall a while back we found this mask. Now, Looks like it's made from actual ghoul skin, which has me a bit concerned. And I suppose that means that, uh... While we're down here, we can just clear this place out to our heart's content. Another 10 mil. Oh, right, I don't have a, uh, a light on anymore. I should have brought a lantern or something so I could see better here. Need the screws in that. Sweet. Wooden cloth. Need both of those. Flamer fuel too. That's pretty good. I already have a decent enough suit back at the base. I already picked up a decent uh, headwear piece too. Something I can kind of disguise myself with should we decide to go into... Um, 
I'm gonna take this off for a second so I can see better. Should we decide to go back into uh, a town somewhere? I, I figure every survivor seems to want to murder us on sight. Um, it's probably probably worth us having a disguise of some sort. So I have a, a wig to cover our, our bald head, you know, and uh, we can wear the gas mask. Enough people, I think, wear a gas mask now that it probably, probably won't raise too much suspicion if we're wearing a full head cover. Got it. So yeah, we'll have a, a setup here that way. We don't get outed by uh, our nasty looking skin. These roaches just have a death wish, don't they? So, we've got a cooking bench over here. I remember there's one uh, not too far away from our base as well, next to the Fen Street sewer entrance, so... I don't have to worry so much about getting all the stuff that's required for um, constantly relighting our fire back at the base, which is oil, mostly oil and cloth. Although, at this point, I have a pretty decent amount of that stocked up as it is. I did make a couple of extra kits for that, so... Now, was I hungry? Yeah, we could eat. I did bring a snack for that. I thought I saw that go off. Oh, I brought my cooked cram too, apparently on accident. Okay, that's fine. We'll just do that. I brought a couple of mute fruit as well, in case we get hungry, but uh, apparently I brought more than just that. Right, so this goes... This just goes back into um, that door there, right? But this goes back in further. I'd like to keep exploring back through here and see what we can find. Maybe I'll clear this out and then go through it properly later on with a, um, a proper headlamp and such. That way we can make our way through here and be able to see everything better. This guy... Doesn't seem so bad. Oh, never mind. Leave me alone. Just move along. All right. Keep moving. Oh, I can't see a damn thing through here. Look, man, I don't want to, I don't want to hurt you, but I also, aren't you like my kind? I don't, I don't want to hurt you, but I don't, I need to get through here. You don't belong here. Get lost. You don't belong here. Get lost. You took the first swing. Remember that. Serrated machete. Well, this is pretty nice. That is pretty nice. Makes them bleed, huh? What's this way? Two? It actually weighs less. And almost double the damage of mine. Hey, there was no need for that. There was no need for that. I'm sorry. You brought this on yourselves. MF. What kind of faction? Put our ghoul mask back on. Oh, I can't see a damn thing. There's some light over here, I guess.
more of these people. Look, we don't have to... Alright, look, for that, I'm taking your cram, your mac and cheese. What's that noise? Let's do this. I thought maybe I'd find the other kind of ghouls down here. Didn't think I'd be finding my own kind of ghoul down here. Stim pack, very nice. Flares, too. Okay, it's all pretty useful. I'm gonna go ahead and use a stim pack, I think. I know we have a badge going, but... Pretty sad that I... got outmaneuvered by some random ghouls in terms of melee, but... not worth the risk. Green line. I hear a turret. Now, I do have explosive to deal with a turret. I don't really have anything else. Well, yeah, I have a frag grenade. Right around the corner here, isn't it? Yep, I see it right there. Should do. Easy enough. We can actually get through here. Got it. That's a big door. Not something I can pick. Okay. Maybe later. Can't tell. Are you? What? Wearing those crazy gas masks. Oh, it's on. Lantern. I could use a lantern. Pretty badly damaged, though. That gun is. Let's see. Don't need this. Uh, we don't need that. I'm thinking about dropping this, but I 
I don't know. I like the faster attack speed on it. We still have room. We can do... Well, I guess we already... We still have our uh, current helmet on, but if we didn't... Yeah, this is something, I guess. It'd be okay for scrounging around down here. Definitely prefer this overall. Everyone down here is just immediately hostile. I mean, these guys, the dead guy here, clearly killed him. Whatever he had. Sawyer's journal. Up there, it's a whole other world. I don't know what they expect to find out there in the snow, but I'll tell you one thing. Only two kinds of people go out there. Wolves and rats. The wolves know the way of the world. They've got the guns, the ammo, and the know-how to make it through the storm. They hunt, they find, they kill. And the rats, well, they've got nothing. But that's just as dangerous, ain't it? Because they got nothing to lose. Very true. I think we've proved that pretty adequately. Being a rat at one point ourselves and now? Well, maybe now we're... Well, I wouldn't call us a wolf. We're a bit too ugly for that after all. I hear the shambling of some ghouls. A couple of dead survivors here. Met with a pretty poor fate, seems like. And a cooking station here. Can dump stuff off here and come back for it later. Have this as kind of a checkpoint. Can I, uh... Yeah, I can make some of this stuff. May as well, I suppose. This mask is pretty ugly, but honestly, it's, uh, not that much worse than my regular face. Let's be realistic here. Brought that stealth boy along, too, just in case we need it. I'm not sure if we will, but eh, you never know. So these two were living on the surface, maybe? And, uh, me it down here, down to some kind of safety, but the ghouls found him. Stuck between ferals and non ferals. Nowhere else to go. Hello. Hmm. Okay, so... Once you're hostile, they're not very happy about it. So attacking one seems to piss off the rest in the area. At least around him. Ones that can detect you. We didn't know, I suppose. Never hurts to have a good pair of shades. A 
Look at that, some Radaway. Not that it really helps us, but I'm sure some non ghoulified person would love to have that. Would probably trade dearly for it. Being able to stay rad free is good as gold these days. Some decent loot down here, and not a lot stopping us from taking it. Yep, there it goes. We are hungry and thirsty. Good thing we got some stuff, right? What's the heaviest stuff we've got? Let's eat that first. And I've got some water, I think. Got some purified water earlier, yeah. Still parched, eh? Can't do much about that unless I find some... Some more wood. I did get some dirty water earlier, I think. But, uh, what's up here? Jesus, that scared me. The library is currently closed. The library is currently closed. I work here. Let me in. Please provide your six digit employee ID number. My ID number is um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, selected officials and managerial types. Always, always too important to remember their own passwords. That's how it typically goes. Okay, let's have a look around. Public library, huh? This does not sound good. I hear human voices too. For these guys specifically, I like this a lot better. They're pretty much all but immune to anything but a good jab to the head. <laughs> Just gotta make sure we take off this mask before we see other humans. If it can fool the ferals, they can probably fool humans at a distance too, and well, that wouldn't be good. I have one IED. Things get really dicey, I could use it. I don't really want to use it unless I have to, though. You're a particularly nasty one, aren't you? Sure, we get a quick kill on him. We can't alert his friends. 
of what we did. Not my most wonderful moment there, but we got the job done, I guess. Definitely should use a bandage again. Are we still okay? Oh, no, we're not okay. It seems like... It seems like this thing has... use. We can, if we're careful, move among them undetected, but... we get too close or take a swing. We're not too happy with us after that. Oh boy. Ooh. Have gone better, but it could have been worse. Shit. <laughs> this is not our day. Not our day. Looks like a barricade over there. Anybody's left alive over there. I don't want them to mistake me for one of these things. Or for, you know, my normal self. <laughs> Hello? Is anyone left? I think they're all dead. No one's left? That's not good. Just seeing what's useful in here, if I can come back later and maybe loot it. Hey, a scrap kit, that's nice. 
Got a couple of those back at the base. Maybe I'll loot everything in here and then uh, dump it all into a kit. Scrap it all up and take bath components. Seems like a good idea. Oh. You don't see that every day. I think we probably go ahead and do another stim pack. Going through them today. Alright, uh... Just call this, you know, me having a funny feeling about this. And yes, we do detect our own minds, by the way. Guess I can turn it off for now. Just burning charges at this point. Alright, um, if there's nobody here, then I suppose we go ahead and put the mask back on. Everybody died, huh? Blue line gate key. Whoa. Now that's a nice gun. That's what I'm talking about. That's a very nice hunting rifle. A bit too heavy for me right now, but holy cow. Ooh. Oh my god. Alright. Bit heavy, but... It's a weed whacker that's been repurposed for ghoul slaying, I suppose. Busted up combat rifle here. Okay. I'm going to dump these into here for now, so I've got them if I want them. That's a very nice assault rifle, though. That's very, very nice. Just don't have room for it right now. This thing's really not that good. Probably won't worry about that. These are pretty reasonable for, uh, for their weight, I guess. And their Federation base. So I did pick up a pair of Alliance fatigues, so I'm not sure if we can disguise ourselves. Maybe we run into these people and they're not friendly to us. Maybe we can just, just disguise ourselves and... Okay. Attention! Security breach near rear entrance. Visitors and employees are advised to seek cover and remain calm. But these guys shouldn't be immediately hostile to me, right? Oh god, there's so many though. I have y'all not tripped, have you not triggered my mind? Just tap dancing around it. Attention. Ooh. Security breach near subway entrance. Visitors and employees are advised to seek cover and
Wait, 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 wait. I'm one of you. We're cool. But now I got a mine out there. And that was too much weight, are you serious? By like one. Aren't we hungry? We can eat something probably. Sure, some insta mash. We're still over encumbered, really? Uh, would you hold something for me, Mr. Ghoul? Hold, uh, this mac and cheese for me. Really? Still overweight? Not sure what happened, why I'm suddenly so overweight. There's an awful lot of them going to be grouped up over there. I wish they weren't running so much. Don't you know there's no, there's no running in the library? have to kill them, but I kind of feel like I should. Even if I didn't want them to not kill other people. It's also just kind of terrible to leave them like this, you know? If I ever go like that, if I'm ever feral, I'd want someone to put me down, put me out of my misery, ideally as quickly as possible. All right. Now look, you've been running through there for like the last five minutes. Surely... That should do the trick. And while we're at it... <laughs> really? You tap danced right around that mine, huh? Didn't even know it was there. Okay, they're not happy with me now, though. Dancing ghouls, man. Security breach neutralized. Visitors may now come and go as they please. All employees, please return to work. Are we good? Nobody else down here? Okay. Well... On the plus side, we get our loot. On the downside, I could have made some friends, I guess. 
There's an area back here, though. Right, I'd like my cooked cram back. Let me, uh, take those. Oh, I can, yeah, I guess from dropping those grenades, now I can pick up my food again. Right, there's an area back here, too. You know, take off my mask just in case. Don't want to scare anybody. You imagine I go through all that and I open up the door and somebody shoots me to think I'm a ghoul? Another ripper, huh? Useful. I'm pretty sure I already have one, though. I'm not really that fond of them. Right, there's all of our good stuff. Okay. Storage room key, eh? See what's in here first. Got it. Eh, nothing much I want. I hope you know I love you. Even if now you're gone and it seems too late. But a flamer. Well, 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 well. Ah, that makes me happy. I don't really have room for it right now, but... Yes, that's quite nice. I'm pretty sure I have some more fuel back at, uh, back at the base. Lady's having a moment back there. Just give her a second. Oh. I'm so sorry. Hey there. Hello. Are you okay? Just stop. Okay? We got our own problems. You're safe. Calm down. As long as those ferals are out there, none of us are safe. You shouldn't have any problems out here. You should head home. Uh, this is all I got at the moment. If you're looking to help out, there are some ferals that need killing. Uh, sure. Okay. Thank you. Make sure you're never followed. It's all our asses if you are. Name's Daisy. That's all you need to know. Do what you gotta do. Oh my god! Let's go! Um... You sure you wanna follow me, though? You know... Knowing what I am? I guess she doesn't know who I am. There we go. Hey, I'm smarter just holding this thing. Some food, some two mil, huh? Is any good? Probably is, uh, about a bust on the weight. You know, the pocket carries, pocket carry weight kind of pays for itself. Hey, a stealth boy. Let me get a IED back as well. I don't have room for everything though. Those two mil were pretty heavy. Yeah, they sure are. About a pound just in those. I can store all this stuff in here for now. How good is this torch? Eh, it's not very good in terms of damage. Have a hard time beating somebody to death with, death with that. So she wants to take her child to a graveyard on the outside and bury her, but don't you know... You know how dangerous it is outside? I'm not sure it's really worth it.
Are you gonna come with then, I guess? Alright, if you're sure, I'll help you. 